What is Tucker? Containerization explained in a simple story. In my previous show, we learned that containerization technology helps software run easily, freely, and independently. But how to put software in a container? How to run the container? To answer those questions, let's meet the hero behind the scene, Docker, a container runtime, and its processes. What is Docker? What is container runtime? What are the processes? It sounds complicated. No worries, let's simply watch a short story. This is Docky. Docky works on a dock. He packs and loads cargoes on vessels. He helps his clients to ship stuff all over the world. It is an important job. Docky likes his job. One day a client named Jane comes to the dock. Jane urgently needs to ship many different packages. How to do that quickly? Docky gets a shipping instruction list. It lists everything on how to ship Jane's stuff in a container, what type of container, how to upload her stuff to the container, and how to ship the container on the boat, etc. This is just like software containerization. First, a container runtime, such as Docker, needs to be available on the server. Next, a Docker file is prepared with all the steps to pack the software to the container, and to run the container on the server. Following the instructions, Ducky works diligently on building Jane's container. This is exactly what the software Docker is doing, building the container following the Docker file instructions. When the container is done, Ducky sticks a label on it, and pushes it to the container warehouse, waiting for the next shipping time. As for the software Docker, the finished container is called container image, just like a container template. Similarly, Docker tags and pushes the image to the image registry, the warehouse. It is time to ship. Docky pulls the container out of the warehouse and uploads it to the boat. Now Jane's stuff is ready to go to the world. At the same time, the software Docker pulls out the image, runs container instances on the server, to serve the world. Congratulations! Now you understand Docker, the container runtime, and its processes. Simple. In the real shipping world, things can be more complicated on a large scale. With so many containers and operations, orchestration is needed. It is the same in the software world. Do you know who is the best container orchestrator? Comment it below. Keep learning. No matter how complex it seems, remember, it is just a docking and shipping business, simple.